Hi everyone, in front of me I've got Oppo A3 and let me share with you how to uh, enable the developer options on this device. So let's start with opening the settings and here we have to scroll down to the very bottom to find about device. Now let's scroll and tap on version. And here we've got the version number, so all we have to do is to keep tapping on it until we will see that we are in the developer mode. Now we can go back to the general settings and enter additional settings, which is right above the above device. And at the very bottom of the list, we've got the developer option, so let's enter. And here we've got plenty of advanced settings, which we can customize. As you can see, we've got a lot of... A lot of options. Uh, so for example, we can manage the apps, like uh, set the background process limit. We can show view updates. Or we can change the window animation scale. Here we've got some options which are connected with the networking because we've got Bluetooth, USB, Wi-Fi, etc. Um, and uh, other options connected with the networking. Basically, all we have to do to turn on the feature is to tap on the switcher. And as you can see, it will be immediately activated and applied. And of course, you can turn it off the same way. If you've got the options without the switcher, like here in the window animation scale, just tap on it to open more options to choose from. If you're done with customization, of uh, develop developer options, you can always turn them off. Just go to the very top of the list and tap on the switcher at the top. You can see that most of the options will be inactive and will actually disappear. Of course, we can enter the settings to check it. Let's go to the additional settings again, and you can see that the developer options disappeared. But of course, no worries, you can customize them again. Just go back to the version number step and keep tapping. All right, so that will be all. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that this video was helpful and if it was, please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up.